Finish Butt Lord now. Great job, hero. Those freedom posers have no idea you fucked them over. All right, guys, listen up. Butt Lord has discovered that the Freedom Pals are infiltrating the police station tonight. We have to get there before they do. The police station? We can't take down the police, are you crazy? Yeah, just let the Freedom Pals go do it. We can't do that, guys. Why not? Because at approximately 10.30 a.m. this morning, Classy was arrested by the police. How do you know? Yo, what the fuck? You came where that little bitch is there, you protect my ass. They only give me one motherfucking phone call, so y'all niggas better come and get me the fuck out of here. Lame ass superhero wannabe motherfucker. We have to help her, fellas. We made a promise. If we let Freedom Pals go do this on their own, then we're the douchebag franchise they say we are. But why would Freedom Pals work with us? Don't forget the new kid is all buddy-buddy with Freedom Pals now. But Lord can trick them into an assault on the lower level of the police station, and meanwhile we'll sneak in and bust Classy out. We're probably gonna get the Freedom Pals killed. And then, whose superhero franchise would be number one? We did make a promise to Classy. Everyone get home and get to bed. We have a big job to do tonight. That'll be all, Butt Lord. Go home and wait to hear from the Freedom Pass. What? What do you want now? What? Again with the puppy eyes. Are you fucking kidding me right now? No, new kid? Absolutely not. You cannot have another class. Look, I'm sorry about what happened to your mother. I know that you want closure, but... Oh. No, I guess I don't know how it feels. You're right. You're right. Maybe you should have just one more class. Plant Mancer. Martial artist. Hmm. I don't really use those. Might as well. Plant Mancer. Like Poison Ivy or Groot. You were laying in bed and you heard your mom scream. You walked out into the hallway. What do you think of this, space boy? <laughs> As a plant mancer hero, you harness the powers of nature to protect, but also to attack. You couldn't stand to watch that innocent alien get bullied. It was time to give those thugs a taste of their own medicine. Under the sweet smelly scent to charm one of the intruders. What the? Interesting. Wow, you smell like flowers. I'll do anything for you. Completely enamored, the intruder was at the mercy of your will. This guy bothering you? Hey! What are you doing? Take this! God, Jesus! How could you fight a child and an alien? Snap out of it, man! Ugh, huh? The blow from his comrade shook off your charm spell, but the confusion had bought the alien some time to recompose itself. It took out its space ray and opened fire on one of its attackers. Okay. You and the alien shared a glance. You could tell it trusted you. She reached to the ground so as to use Mother Nature's power to defeat the alien's attackers. Roots wow. Ground, dropping the alien bullies to the ground in a twisted wave of wood. Oh yeah, that's gonna be useful. Jesus, I'm out of here. Yeah, fuck your plants, kid. Your newfound alien friend breathes a sigh of relief. Boo. But then a third intruder entered the hallway. Boo. And he also wanted to beat up the alien, so he did. The alien couldn't take the beating sitting down, of course. It retaliated with another shot of its space ray. You can see the alien was fighting for dear life, so you summoned the gentler side of your plant powers to heal it. Oh, and we get a tack up? Intruder mercilessly continued to pummel your new space friend until it was unconscious. Ooh, ooh. Watching the alien fall sprouted something inside of you. You summoned all of your plant matter power to revive your fallen friend. Oh wow, that's uh. Mother Nature heard your call and bestowed her bountiful gifts upon you and the alien. Wow, that's interesting. of a support class the glory of the final blow rarely falls on your shoulders move, move. but you're always on the winning side wow okay you ran to your parents door and before anything bad could happen you ran inside to protect your mom but you were too late your dad totally fucked you oh it must be tearing you apart inside 
how people can do that to other people, I just, I'm, I'm so sorry. Anyway, we've got work to do tonight. I'll see you at the police station. There's nothing more to talk about. I'll be in touch tonight after your parents think you're sleeping. this the last night out it was three in the last game should be three in this one i think you stupid fucking cow have another glass of chardonnay why don't you i have to drink to deal with you that marijuana is changing you somehow at least marijuana is natural not like grapes you're fucking hot! Maybe so, but I'm not telling everyone our child's secrets! Go be paranoid some more in your room, Chris! Have another drink, Kelly! Go be paranoid some more in your room, Have Chris! Have another drink, Kelly! Oh, hey, kiddo! Daddy's gonna go upstairs to his room. Mommy's gonna go get a drink. <laughs> your mom's name is Kelly? Interesting. Or maybe he was just using Kelly as... Okay. No food this time. I was making sure I didn't forget. <laughs> Sweetie, you forgot to eat your dinner. Mommy put it down on the table. Come on, honey. Gotta eat your supper. Did you put more of that stuff in our child's food? Shut your fucking mouth! How do we know that medicine doesn't have side effects, huh? You know her child needs the medicine as much as I do! Uh, you drunken whore! Fucking butthead! How dare you make our child choose sides! You put the medicine in his food, too! I'm not having anyone choose sides! Go on down and eat your supper, champ. Can we peek? Stupid fucking bitch! Fucking hate you! Okay. I thought it would be both of them. They both went that way, but all right. Wait, before I eat the food. she in the kitchen? No, she's in the bathroom then. go to sleep no kid get dressed and meet me out front hurry the night awaits cool room still gone Alright, here we'll go. Part three. Escape in the house. Oh, this I guess this time they don't care. Oh, it's not locked. Cool. It's about time. You know how hard it is to look mysterious when you're just standing around in some kid's front yard? No. It's fucking hard. I'm glad you're with us, new kid. It's been tough being the only one on the team with real superpowers. While all the other kids are playing and working on their franchise plans, I'm stuck defending the city against evil. Hey. There's barely any time to work on my pitch for a Mysterion spin-off movie. Sometimes it feels like a curse having these powers. You know how it is, because you're like me. I'm sure the power of your ass weighs heavy on you. Don't 
don't like to talk about it. That's okay, I understand. Let's just get to the police station and find the evidence we need. Here comes that pallet. No, ma'am. No, please don't. I'll be a good boy, I promise. Wow, the adults in this town are really out of their fucking minds. They're, uh... I don't know. Damn. What a bunch of dicks. It's worse than I thought, new kid. This is not normal. Wow. You're really mysterious, new kid. And coming from Mysterion, that's really high praise. This town, boy. At night time, this town. All right, Freedom Pals, here's the plan. Once we get inside the police station, Toolshed and the new kid will set up a diversion and then the... Wait a minute. What the fuck? Yeah, come on, guys. Uh, we've got to get inside the police station. What are you assholes doing here? We're here to investigate a hot lead regarding the South Park police. Uh, that's what we're doing. Oh, no. No, no. This is our superhero mission, Freedom Pals. Fuck you guys. Get lost before there's a fight. Fellas, fellas, have we all forgotten there's a little girl in trouble in there? Fast pass is bad. I suppose that just this once we should put our petty differences aside and work together. All right, Mysterion, what's the plan? I think some of us should cause a diversion. Make the cops head towards it so the rest of us can sneak in without the cops noticing. Good idea. Coon friends will go up the fire escape and cause the diversion so Freedom Pals can sneak in the front. This is all pretty coincidental. Did you guys just steal our lead again? Innocent people are being arrested, Toolshed. That's all that matters to us. It should be all that matters to you. Okay, Coon friends up the fire escape. Come on, guys. Stand by. We gotta wait for the diversion. Come take a look at this. Okay, hold up. Oh, oh boy. Man, that's strong shit. Yeah, does this coke seem a little off to you? No, no, this is sweet. You guys want to call some hookers? What the fuck was that? Come on, let's check it out. Bring the coke. All right, come on, Butler. The coast is clear. Let's go. Oh shit, criminals. And they have guns probably. Code red. Assault on the precinct. Dumbass. Wow, I didn't see that coming. Idiot. Ah, shit. I guess we're dealing with these guys ourselves. Oh my gosh, that plant man, sir? Good power. Like wow, that's gonna be so useful. Time to violate some civil uh. Hope I remember to charge my taser. All right. uh. Wow, that's crazy. to party, not beat up kids, but here we are. Oh, man, oh crap, those things are dangerous. Yeah, I'll just skip this turn, but I'm tired of doing that right now. Damn. You're gonna die, brother. You're gonna die. You have the right to get your Yeah, that's it.
Can he heal? Well, he can, but I don't, I'm not close to anybody I can heal. Whatever. This might get ugly. That them? Okay. She liked this part of the game. It's about to get interesting. That's enough. Just stand down, kid. Look, I know why you're here. You're fed up. Because you think all cops do is harass black people. I know that to a young kid it can seem like cops are racist and bigoted. But you can't believe what the media tells you. Cops are just people. Like you. Your friends, your family, people who work hard to- Spook! Oh! Uh, Tupperware! Damn it, Levinsky, get your ass upstairs, sir! And turn on the alarm! That fucking asshole shot at me! Get him! This isn't going to get any easier, but those cops need to pay. That looks like an override switch. I don't know how to get past that turret, though. I don't know how to get past that turret, though. I know how to get past it. Do I have enough time? That's the question. Jesus, there's another one. Forget the other one. I don't know how to get to that one, but I know how to go this way. Oh. Damn. It's so close to the actual thing that I could mess up real quick. She got an item because <laughs> I missed it. Hey, Stanley, I, I, uh, uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, shit, I'll be right back. I'm starting to think coming here was a bad idea. Hey, get us out of here. Token, thank God you're here, son. Dad, what the fuck are you doing here? This is messed up. Hey, you're the one who got me put in here. <laughs> oh, hey, kiddo. You're probably wondering why we're in jail. Well, your mom took a call from your school where she confirmed our proud but previously secret African-American heritage. It's totally not your fault, dear. No, it's your mom's fault for being fucking stupid and reckless. I mean, I'm sure it'll all be okay. Hey, maybe you can get us out of here? Yes, how about that, dear? Hey, you're that little what asshole that got, got me in us. here. But while you're here, mind hitting that button on the wall? They're trying to free the criminal. Get down, get down. Ow. Now let's do this fight. Get down and then lock you up, as is my constitutional right. Are you now? Hmm. That kid's mother must be proud. Must be exciting for you kids to see us law Yeah, let's just end him. Hands up! Oh, suddenly 
all of this tinfoil doesn't seem like such a good idea. I got just the tool for this job. Foam Destroyer. You're dead. Anyone got a tourniquet? Shit! Dad doesn't let me watch him play with his tool. Nobody move! Gah. Yeah! Relax, Chaos. You'll survive. Almost. Okay, okay. I know this looks bad. You really think cops just go around arresting black people for no reason? Yes. What purpose could that possibly serve? Your it's purpose. First discrimination. That's what it is. If we were all black cops and our jails were filled with white people, nobody would say a word. So I guess you've learned that the real bigots here are you. Huh, kids? Guess you can all go home. No? Fuck. Is to you. <laughs> We're innocent, so breaking out of jail isn't a crime, right? I'm not sticking around to find out. I smell a class action lawsuit. Supreme Court, here we come. Token, what did I tell you about playing too rough? Mom, I was defending justice. I don't care what you were defending. You could have gotten hurt. But Tokor can't get hurt. He's impervious to pain. Is he impervious to getting his butt spanked? That's right. Hey, kid, I was just messing around about the government. They're not so bad. They're actually pretty good guys. Hey, the big cool man is listening to us right now. Just that natural. Oh, shit, they're probably tracking this call. I'm fucking out of here. This. <laughs> Is there anything else over here? No? Uh 
That was interesting. Interesting. Ah, shit. Here comes the chaos. Come here, little minion. In the boat. what a cop is, new kid. A cop is a slave. A robot who's told not to think for himself. It's the politicians who are the real bigots. That mayor has been sitting in her office telling us we have to change our ways. The only way to have her removed was to raise crime in the streets. And now cops are finally able to do things the old way again. Don't you see this is better for everyone? Holy shit, that scramble! What? You found the missing cat, Butlord! Freedom pals, we've got the police chief! Top floor! What can I say? You kids have me by the balls. Almost by the balls. You know, not every prisoner we have here is black. We actually do have one white guy. This is a trap! I'm sorry, kids, but you left me no choice. He's still looking good. Eating the subway sandwiches. His name is Jared, and he's still looking good. Hey, kids. You want some candy? Oh, fuck, it's Jared. You'll excuse me if I don't want to watch this. Conjugal visits. Okay, this is going to be an interesting battle. <laughs> Damn, he got that health. Team, I haven't slept in two years. Already comes to Thanks, AIDS. This is all going exactly according to my PR plan. <laughs> Say cheese. Oh, God, no pictures. Do not post that online. Damn, that's a lot of health. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's an interesting power to use. <laughs> okay. You want some candy? Call girl heats the calls. Let's go. Epic slot. Let's go. I think I'm max level on that. What are the police doing with the people they arrested? Oh, how should I know? I'm just a sandwich guy. New kid, fart in his face. No, no, please, please, I'm sorry. I'll tell you anything. What is the police chief hiding? There's, there's more cells down below. Cops take that elevator. Prisoners go down there, but they don't come back. What's the code? Uh, come on, how should I know, huh? Ah, ah, yeah, yeah, I seen him type it in. 
1477. Please, I, I'm sorry. It's just that I like being with children, you know, because I, because I never had a childhood of my own. Yeah, that's it. I like kids because I never had a childhood. It's your decision, new kid. Part of being a superhero is deciding what to do in moments like these. No mercy. All right, well, that was pretty uncomfortable. I know being a vector for disease is kind of my thing, but I, I feel kind of dirty. Should we do anything with the body? Yeah. <laughs> We're supposed to go this way. He grabbed my proboscis. What the fuck are you talking about, buddy? You got a soft heart, kid. Maybe too soft. Ah! Yeah. There's nothing in here. Okay, let's just go to the door. This is a one-time shot, Coon. After tonight, we are enemies again. Our petty little differences aren't what matter right now, Mysterion. Black lives matter. Yeah, dick. You're a fucking dick, Mosquito. Let's go open the gate. Well, come on. The morgue? Okay, we could go to the morgue. There's nowhere else to go but down here. I got a bad feeling about this place. If this takes much longer, I huh? What was that? Hello? Hello, is someone there? No, I guess no one's there. Or else they would have said something. All right, then. It's just me and you, kitty. No one's gonna find us in here. Come on. Give me that good stuff. Hey, stop it. Hold still. Oh, bananas. The cat got away. Can't see a thing in here. Sounds like the cat's getting into the toxic chemicals. Darn it, that's not good. I hope those weren't the toxic chemicals I was just talking about that broke on the floor just now. Oh no, I, I think they were. Drat. Those chemicals mixed together on the floor, it'll turn into a gas that'll kill me in seconds. Blast it, there's the gas. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely killing me now. <laughs> oh, oh, thank God. The exhaust fan's sucking out the toxic gas. <sighs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm not gonna die. Now, where's that blasted cat? <laughs> oh, no. I think the cat just jumped into the exhaust fan and jammed it. Gas is filling up the room and it's killing me again. I'm dying again. Sounds like the emergency door closed. Yep, the emergency door closed. I'm trapped in here. I need to get out of here. Just have to <coughs> feel around for the doorknob. Here. here Yo, is. what is happening right now? The door's locked. I'm stuck in here. Somebody help me. 
gas is killing me. I'm really dying. The time. Seriously, I can feel myself dying. It's so painful. Help! For the, for the love of everything up here. If you're there and you can hear me right now, do something. It's, it's killing me. It's killing me. Wait. I think I feel the light switch. With my left breath, I'll just turn it on. Damn, dude. Won't that kill me if I open that door? Hold up. I don't want to open that up. I'm going to die. Well, fuck it. We already died once. Fuck it. Might as well die again. Okay. I don't even know what I got. What did what the fuck did I even pick up? Was this all worth it? Like, was this all important? 